Hey nerds, Jared Bear here. Welcome back to the channel. It is Friday, which means it's time for some fan films. If there's one thing that I really, really enjoy, it is this time of the week. It's the Fan Film Friday. I love seeing what people have created. There's a recommended video for the up next thing that I already want to plan for in the future. I love fan films. I love people who want to get into filmmaking and their starting point is YouTube or starting point is their own content creation of making short films and acting and etc. I love these so, so much. I've watched some really good ones. I've watched actual actors such as Nathan Fillion in the Uncharted one, uh, Jamie Costa in the Star Wars one. Like, what was the other one he did? He did Han Solo, and then he also did another character, too, that I really enjoy. Oh, he also did old Obi-Wan. He's done two Star Wars ones. Star Wars, I think, is probably the easiest thing to do because there's so much lore. Um, I've watched multiple lightsaber battles. I've watched uh, other fan films that will be posted in the future. I watched uh, Batman or Superman meets Batman or however that title was, fan film. And just watching these average, everyday people give acting a shot in these is really cool. I, I really, really enjoy Fan Film Friday. So with that being said... Today's video is sticking with Star Wars. This is a 2018 fan film called Odyssey, a Star Wars story. A runtime of 12 minutes and 3 seconds. If you guys want to watch it uninterrupted, avoid my commentary and pausing. You can uh, click the link in the description box down below. The title and the channel link will be there. This is posted by Mav Films, uh, LLC. They have 16,000 subs, and this video has almost 2.2 million views. Ugh. So, with that in mind, hope you guys are ready. We're going to watch this together, react to this together, and I honestly, I can't wait. So, let me turn, why's the volume off? Jerry, my very esteemed co-host, look at him, he's adorable. He works best behind the scenes. And, let's just go right into it. 12 minutes, kind of short, shortest, probably the shortest fan film so far, but... I love people's homemade droids. Why do they always look so good? When I look at you, we're on the Falcon. I see what I used to be. I remember that feeling when I made my choice. You think you just joined a cause, but instead you became a soldier. And I know. You're not sure if that's what you want. But by being here, you've already made a choice. It's really hard for me not to say narration and then Listen for the cinema sins. <laughs> Being one thing I love about Star Wars, you decided to be part of something bigger than yourself. Is this here as because well? Because you believed what they were doing was wrong, and you decided to take action. Hell yeah! Also get Halo vibes as well. I'm pretty sure Halo has heavy inspiration from Star Wars, anyways. Star Wars, Doom, etc. What is this group of people, though? Like, they're, I thought that logo for a second was Mandalorian, but obviously it's not. Didn't something like that happen in Rogue One? This almost exact thing's going on? Kind of digging that. Come on, buddy. Do your job, brother. <laughs> I 
Everybody fall. Dude, what is you like it or not? The decision you make will become who you are. Oh, yeah, yeah. Rebel scum. Dad. The blaster doesn't make you a soldier. What you do with it does. That's a bar. Oh. Pretty soon, others are going to depend on you to be that soldier. It's going to be okay, son. Look away. Look away! Look away, child! When it's life or death, you will see the reality of this war. It's gonna be okay. But don't forget the future. Don't forget what we're fighting for. He's gonna pull that trigger. Save him. Save him! I don't even know this dude's backstory. Nothing. Hell yeah. Wilhelm scream. got flying in here baby hey that twist on the Star Wars theme that was smooth Did Evac already pick up some people? Is that what just happened? I hear the Star Wars music in my head. Hey, get him up. Get him up. Ah! system 
those the bomber things? More than you know. Oh man, old as shit now. Living his best life. Soldier or not, you shouldn't be out there without this. Quinn. You have a purpose with us. Okay, that's not the same guy. I don't know why, I thought that was just the same dude, just older. Tower at North Beach, 12 clicks from drop site. Other squads have perimeter at South Beach. Get out of sight and await further orders. Oh, so they already showed everything that happened while this guy was narrating before it's actually happened. Good luck. I'll be watching over. Odyssey Squadron. You're ready for drop. Five. Four. Oh shit. No way. Bunch of bunch of bunch of credits. Yo. Okay, I did not know that was the direction that was going in. I thought all this was playing out and my man was narrating. He's like, hey man, I made a lot of bad decisions in my life. I thought he was the one that made the decision to take that shot, but his story inspired slash motivated little buddy to take that shot to free the dad and the son before everything took place so it was kind of uh tarantino-esque storytelling not really it's just kind of what, what, there's a word for that it's just like when they say yeah we're gonna we're gonna clean up the place and we're gonna wash down the windows and the whole time they're doing the cleaning montage and then it just it wraps up there at the end but this is telling the story that's going to happen and then ending with them going into battle. I really like that. Uh, his, Him taking that shot saved the life of a father and a son. Rebels, apparently. But on the flip, cost the lives of two, three, four, five people. But they also, at the same time, managed to hack the tower. I feel like just hacking that tower so they can, you know, take care of the Star Destroyers. You could have got all your men there and back. But he saw one instance where he felt he needed to save those people. And unfortunately, it cost others. This was well done, dude. This looked like it would be, um, I mean, it definitely had movie qu movie quality shots and scenes. And the weapons looked rugged and real. And looked like something that would actually be in the Star Wars universe. It's really good. I feel like we heard Anakin's Dark Deed there for a second, which I can't wait to get an email about that, but that's okay. Um, Odyssey, a Star Wars story, 2018. Well, well done. I hope the people that are make that made this video, uh, you continue to pursue this passion and you make more content because I would love to watch it. And with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and dip out. So I'm going to put up playlist here. I'm going to put up the fan film playlist. I'm going to recommend probably a Star Wars fan film. And uh, as always, make sure to check back for gameplays, commentaries, news, and updates. Later, Neds.